Okay, here's a little walk around video on the BMW. I'll show you any imperfections that I know um, on there. I did drive it just a little bit and it seemed to drive very nice, but I'll show you any imperfections I see. Just kind of ran it through the wash here, so it might be a little wet, but um, we'll start off by the driver's side wheel. Um, looks like it's in uh, good shape there. You can see the tires. Definitely not new. There's the wear bars right there. So you probably got about five, 30 seconds or so. So not a ton of life left on the front tire there at least. Come around the front bumper. Definitely got some uh, some little, I don't know, I guess that's the clear, probably chips, rock chips and stuff from highway driving on the front. So when you get up on it, you can see that. And you can see little tiny ones across the the plastic bumper hood you got a little couple little rock chips there and definitely you know scattered wear on the front nothing out of the ordinary but definitely normal wear it wasn't just a around town car it looks like they definitely did some highway miles and looking at the paint on the hood not really noticing anything too crazy um, definitely can see some car wash marks on the paint. I don't know if this is picking it up here on camera, but nothing like super substantial. It's not like swirled to crazy heck, you know, it should, uh, a little bit of polish should be fine. Everything on the top of the car looks like it's in pretty good shape. The driver's door, all that looked pretty good. I didn't see any major nick marks. That looks like just a little bit of wax there. Come over to the rear tire. See something here. Probably hit something. Chip the paint off of the wheel there. Little nick there. And the rear tire. A little bit more life to that rear tire compared to the front. A couple little, little marks there. And then coming over to the back bumper, got a little missing paint right there on the edge. A couple light scratches here. Rear bumper. Another couple little light marks there, there. Truck looks pretty good. Over the rear quarter on the passenger side. Check out these rear tires. Look about the same as the other side. Wheel on this one looks like it's in good shape. And a little bit of dust there. Some very fine scratches there and there. Don't know if I can get them on camera. Kind of see it there. Very fine though, not deep at all. Definitely things that should polish pretty well. So passenger side door, okay, the, this I would consider a little more substantial, so you've got some deeper scratches, maybe from a car next to it, swing the door open on that passenger side, front wheel, it's in pretty good shape, something rubbed on the wheel right there on the edge, but nothing, nothing crazy. Looks pretty good there. Come over to the interior. Interior's in a very nice shape for 100,000 miles. Definitely doesn't look like it was beat up or anything. Seats all in good shape. They're not all wore out and cracked leather or anything like that. Center console, dashboard, all looks like it's in good shape. Driver's side. Steering wheel. I'll go around the other side as well. You can see that. So rear, rear door, all good shape there. Seats in the back look very nice. Come around to the driver's side. Again, everything nice shape. Door. And 
driver's side. Got a little dirt down here. Memory seats, power windows, locks, of course. Not all beat up here, which is good. Power seat, all the seats in good shape. And then this one does have the power tilting telescoping steering wheel, heated steering wheel, audio controls there, paddle shifters, of course, push button start, the screen with the nav, heated seats, ventilated seats, dual climate control. Looks like some sort of a sport and comfort position there. A hill descent, looks like backup camera, backup sensors. And then I believe this controls the radio and navigation system. Of course, our electronic shifter there. Everything's in real nice shape for 100,000 miles. Nice looking car and seems to run real nice. If there's anything else additionally you wanted to see, just let me know.